Next is question number 2.17. The vapor pressure of water is 12.3 kilopascal at 300 Kelvin. Calculate vapor pressure of one molar solution of a non-volatile solute in it. So here since they are talking about vapor pressure of water and of a non-volatile solute, we will consider the formula of relative lowering of vapor pressure. Alright, so the formula for relative lowering of vapor pressure is PA0 minus PA divided by PA0 which is the relative lowering of vapor pressure that is going to be equal to the mole fraction of the solute. Alright, now when they say one molal solution, what is the meaning of it? So you can write that one molal means one molal solution means one mole of solute in one kg solvent in this case in general when we say solution the solvent has to be water and it's mentioned here also so here one kg of solvent meaning thousand grams all right now here xb is given but that is not given to us in the question anywhere directly so let's solve xb first xb is nothing but mole fraction of the solute so if it's mole fraction of the solute then it's going to be nb by na plus nb which is the number of moles now number of moles is also not given to us directly okay so we are going to calculate it now when you say that NB is the solute and NA is going to be the solvent. Here it says one molal solution. In that it says one molal solution meaning one mole of solute. So when it says one mole of solute, in this case, your value for NB is given to you directly. One mole. <coughs> NA is for the solvent. Solvent given mass is there. We just have to calculate it directly. So, Na is equal to given mass of the solute. Given mass of the solute here, of the solvent here is going to be 1000 grams. So, 1000 grams, alright, divided by molar mass of the solvent. What is the solvent here? Water. Of solvent, we all know it by heart, for water it is 18 gram per mole, the molar mass. When I divide both of this, I will get 55.55 moles. Okay, so now we have Na, Nb. Let's substitute it here. So Xb is equal to Nb is 1 divided by 55.55 plus 1. Now when I simplify this, I will get the mole fraction as 0 0.017 as the value of Xb. Alright, now, <coughs> that is the right side of the equation. What about the left side? PA0 is given as vapor pressure of water, 12.3 kilopascal. We need to calculate what is the vapor pressure of the non-volatile solute, which is PA. So, here, let us put the form, substitute the values. PA0 is in the question, that is 12.3 kilopascal minus PA is what we have to calculate divided by PA0 is same 12.3 kilopascal equals 0 0.017. Now we have to just cross multiply both. When we cross multiply this you will get 12.3 kilopascal minus PA equals 0 0.017 into 12.3. When you cross multiply you will get 0 0.2091 kilopascal. Now take out PA, it will become minus PA is equal to 0.2091 kilopascal minus 12.3 kilopascal. Now here this will be minus PA is equal to, when you minus both you will get minus 12.090 kilopascal. Left side minus and right side minus both will get cancelled and final answer is going to be PA is equal to 12.090 kilopascal which is the vapor pressure of one molal solution of the non-volatile solute.